Good morning. It's like 8.30 in the morning. Just beginning to get up. But I'm gonna open this Bibbidi Bobbidi Boxes box right now anyway. Um, yeah. So I will let you know what's inside when I've opened it. I'm opening the box and look at this, it's cute. I've already started eating it. It's a good box. Yes. Spirit jersey, the Hercules backpack. Mmm. Thank you. Okie dokie, we are all done. Today is our last weekday of the trip. It's Friday. And we're gonna find some breakfast and then get down to the Staten Island Ferry. And head to Staten Island. It's McDonald's breakfast. Craig has got is, is, is getting his breakfast. But this is like a McDonald's that I love because it's like an American McDonald's, right? They've got like music videos on the top there. It's a really big McDonald's. It goes all the way up there and you can sit up there and stuff. And also, they still do Happy Meal toys for McDonald's. So they've got a load of the Onward Happy Meal toys. Whereas back in the UK, we just have books now, I think. Which is great, but the whole point of Happy Meals is that they come with a toy. Um, so yeah, very cool McDonald's. I like it here. And it's got TLC, no scrubs on right now, so. So we are making our way to Lower Manhattan. I know, they're so cute. The dogs over there, police dogs. They're so sweet. Oh, dogs. I love dog handling policemen. The way I know. We are making our way to Lower Manhattan. We're gonna hop on the Staten Island Ferry, which is free to Staten Island. So come along with us for this this fun ride on the sea. On the sea? <laughs> it's not the sea. On a boat. These stations are so cool. I love them. Very cool. You say that to a New Yorker though, they'll be like. Yeah. We are just waiting for the Staten Island Ferry and my mum is here from Rio de Janeiro. <laughs> mum, say hi. Hi! <laughs> we'll catch you in a second. Here we go, onto the ferry. It is a bad rush. Everyone is crowding onto the ferry. The last time I came to America, this was how I saw the Statue of Liberty. We went on the Staten Island Ferry and yeah. just looked over like that. And that was pretty much how I saw it before. So I'm very glad that I've now been on that island and seen it up close and personal and stuff. But yeah, very, very cool. There is something I find quite strange on these ferries though, and it is the fact that all the life jackets are like above your head, just there. And it's all the same inside as well as outside. There's just life jackets all in the ceiling. This is cool. I've just had a little wonder and I've come out the back of the boat. Look. There's no one here. That's how close I am to the water now. That's a really good view. We made it to Staten Island. We are on Staten Island right now. Uh, just going to passenger pickup where we're gonna find Frank and then head to the mall. We have made it to the mall on Staten Island. We're here with Frank. There's Frank. Frank, say hi. <laughs> we are going into Hot Topic, Box Lunch, and all of the cool stores. Hot Topic. Du -du 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 -du. Staten Island has a very cute looking Disney store. Look at the entrance to this place. <laughs> very, very cute. It's all the same, but some things never change. I couldn't stop and say you no. Know. It's all the same, but you won't take the blame. Even when you are blowing up. We are now in a box lunch. I love box lunch. They've got loads of stuff. So let's take a look around. Nobody's gonna say even though oh my
Hello everybody, we have not been vlogging very much today, but we have been shopping quite a bit. So Craig has got a few bits in his bag. The outlet in um, Jersey, really, really, really good. Very good bargain stuff in there. And all of this stuff will appear in a haul video at some point, I guess. But yeah, we're on the ferry back to Manhattan now, so I'm going to go and take a look outside because we're gonna get a really good view of the Manhattan skyline at night and it's going to be very pretty. You won't take light Even when you are blowing up Oh my, oh my Oh my, you're broken up Nobody's gonna save him now Oh my, oh my Oh my, you're broken up So come on, let me show you Big surprise, we aren't at Ellen's today. We've made it back to the room. It's, I, uh, this has been a very short day in the vlog, I know, I know, but we were shopping, so I don't know. But we did go to New Jersey, so we have been to two states in this trip. We've been to New York and New Jersey. Very exciting stuff. Totally recommend, if, you'll go, if you wanna go outlet shopping, go to the outlet mall in New Jersey. It's not actually that far. Get the Staten Island Ferry to Staten Island and then from there, there is a, there's the Empire Outlets. I don't know why I'm doing that because that's what it's actually called. The Empire Outlets, which are okay, but they don't have that much stuff. But New Jersey is 15, 20 minutes in a cab, or in a car, and it's so much better. They've got loads of different outlet stores, uh, stores. Craig's bought a bunch of stuff from Coach for dirt cheap. I mean, like seriously dirt cheap. Like, um, it's supposed to be like a six hundred pound bag, six hundred dollar bag, and he got it for a hundred and fifty dollars or something. So, really, really good prices for the stuff that you're getting. They've got a Hot Topic in there. They've got Disney Store in there. There's loads of stuff. Abercrombie and Fitch. Michael Kors, loads of stuff. So check out the Jer the outlets in New Jersey. They're not that far, and yeah. Definitely go if you are a shopaholic. Okie dokie, it is Saturday, Saturday, Saturday? It's Saturday today. Today is our last like full day here. We've spent the morning kind of just chilling and watching The Huntsman on TV. And now I'm just gonna pack up our stuff as best as I can so I don't have to worry about doing it later on tonight. And then we're gonna head out. Maybe go, I, I still haven't been to Magnolia Bakery and we still haven't had a bagel and we still haven't done Ellen's, so I have three food things on my list for today. So we'll go and get that done. And then, yeah, it's good. I like that we've, we did so much at the beginning of the week, so now we can really just like chill and relax for the rest of it, which is good, because it gives our feet a break. We've done loads and loads of packing. We are pretty much good to go. You see all our stuff is mostly suitcased up now. Uh, my suitcase is all done. So all good to go for tomorrow. Everything else we're just gonna shove into our bags. But yeah, I think we're, we're doing quite well. We are gonna head out to find a bagel, find Magnolia Bakery, and then eventually we're gonna go to Ellen's tonight. So, food day today. You ready? Yep. Let's go. Oh my goodness, it's a beautiful day. Beautiful, sunny. It's beginning to get a lot warmer. And, um, well, a lot, as I say. Well, it's a bit of a statement, yes. It's getting warmer, and next week it's supposed to be even warmer. But, it doesn't matter. It's not been cold, cold while we've been here, so it's all good. We're on the way down towards Carrie's apartment, because that's near where Magnolia Bakery is, and we've just stopped by Chelsea Market. So we're gonna go and check a look, have a look inside. There's not just food, there's other stuff too. Oil, salts, and spices. <laughs> Ooh. Let's check it out. So Chelsea Market is, it, I'm getting Camden Market kind of vibes, but like, uh, what did I call? What did I call it? Higher end. It's higher end Camden Market with loads of stuff in it. Very fast witch bakery. Ooh. That looks cool. Fat witch bakery. New York City. Handmade since 1923. They are cute. 
These are cute as well. It's little egg baskets. Yeah. Next month. Duh. <laughs> What's that? That looks cool. The water. Very cool. Oh look, a wishing wall. If you don't know what that reference is to, shame on you. Mickey Mouse cartoons. So good. Um, so we have some change here. We're gonna make a wish. You wanna make a wish? I want, I'm gonna put the 50 in. So I have a, a better chance of it coming through. Make a wish. Make a wish into the world. That's all you have to do. There we go. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna flick it like that. Like this. It went right down. I hope I got that on camera. It went right down in the hole. You'll know if my wish comes true if I suddenly have lots of extravagant things and Big place. visit lots of different countries flying business class <laughs> and a brand new house in multiple different cities. <laughs> but I'm not telling you what my wish is, otherwise it won't come true. Oh, the, um, purge, yeah. <laughs> so Emily told me to go in here. She, I, we're literally just walking past it now. It's the Starbucks Reserve Roastery. So we are checking it out. and Terry's chocolate orange and quality street and stuff in the window. So we're gonna go in and take a look. They've even got a Union Jack on the bench. Bleecker Street. Bleecker Street is where Magnolia Bakery is. Now, I'll tell you, oh, it's there. It's not even it's there on the corner, I think. <laughs> now, Magnolia Bakery featured in an episode of Sex in the City. What, this actual one? Yeah, I think it's this one. The Carrie and Miranda were sat outside it eating a cupcake, and that's what started. I don't know if I told you this already. I might have told you this already. Definitely. But that's what started the whole cupcake craze with like cupcake bakeries like popping up everywhere and everything. This is the Magnolia Bakery. I think the accent kind of threw the, the guy off. I asked for Carrie's cupcake so I could be super basic and get the same cupcake that Carrie had in Sex and the Sea. But, um, yeah, I got the confetti cupcake instead. But it still tasted really good. But I also got the banana pudding because apparently that's an amazing thing to have and try and it's one of their newer things, I think. Um, so I'm giving the banana pudding a go. <laughs> oh, wow. <It's> like, I... <laughs> Ooh, right. Oh, hold, hold this dairy. <laughs> Dairy. 
Wow. Is it really banana -y? Mm. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Okay. Let's give this. Oh, it's got like good bread in it though. Really banana. Not really. Okay, let me try. Mm. Enough. Mm. Really good. Boop, 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 boop. Mm. It's all right though, it's bearable. Good. Maybe that's that. But we're inside Macy's and we've come up to the, the toy floor and they've got these little window displays that, that are showcasing Miracle on 34th Street. It's very cute. You got like, I can't remember the names, but there's the, the little kid and her mum and the judge with all the letters and there's the real Santa there getting off with um thingy. Yeah, this is the, the, um, the original. The original because of the way that they're clients. It's so cute though. So yeah, the parade, the parade. So. Yeah, and her mum's like, no, we don't believe in it. Blah 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 blah. It's cool. Millions of toys. Ah, this is annual Thanksgiving Day parade. Yeah, please. Yeah. Oh, I want to see it now. Yeah, I've not seen it. I want to. Santa returns in November. <laughs> Obviously, keep their Christmas stuff up all year. So it's cute. You can get, like, there's the, the 34, number 34 Express. And Santa Land is through there. I don't know, because they didn't. In the original, they did. Oh, did they? I think so, well, according to the posters. Oh yeah, that's true. Maybe, I don't know. Because in, obviously, the new one, it's Coles. They go, yeah, it's yeah, Coles. Which is also now a real place. But it's, yeah, Macy's. They also have wooden escalators in Macy's. Like, at, on the top levels, so you can see here, wood. They sound different to, to the metal ones, but they, they're very cool. Look. Craig was saying we used to have these in the London Underground until they all burnt down. All of the, the kings were fired. Oh, yeah, well. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Hello. Um, I'm never going to get bored of looking up at these buildings. They're ridiculously tall. Like, really tall. See? Uh, we're heading to Abercrombie. There's a, there's a jumper I really want to get from Abercrombie. So we're heading back there. Uh, and now that I think about it, I don't really have the money for Ellen's. It's, it can be quite pricey, a little bit pricey, because it's, I've literally been wanting to go that entire time we're here. But no, I, I'm, I'm not gonna blow all my money. When we've had a really good trip and we've done all this stuff, I don't wanna go home and be in debt because of a meal, so. I'm gonna buy a hoodie instead. Logic. It's the Rockefeller Center. These are uh, some of the 13 buildings. Yeah. This was originally the World Trade Center, wasn't it? Was it? Yeah. Ah. Uh, Back in the day, and then they built the Twin Towers. Yeah, these buildings are actually all connected underground. So it's, yeah. Yeah. But it's all part of, that's part of it. Radio City is part of it. Christie's down there is part of it as well. It was a fascinating tour. It was good. Yeah. I like all the art as well. So it's all got meaning. Like, yeah. Behind, like television, radio. But you wouldn't think it because it looks like old, old art. That's definitely another one of my tips though for, for New York. If you come to New York, do the tours. Like, don't think, oh, it's a tour, it's gonna be boring, or oh, it's a tour, it's gonna be long. It's fascinating. You learn so much stuff about like the area everything that, that went into building up the area. Well, obviously, you, it's a tour. You're gonna to learn about whatever the hell the tour's about. But do the tours, they're really interesting. I love them. We are going into FAO Schwartz. It's, um, I think, I think, I think, this is the store from, from Big, the movie Big, when he was playing on, um, he played on that giant thing, the, 
do 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 thing. Keyboards, giant keyboards. But um, yeah, I'm not entirely sure, so don't quote me on that. I might be wrong. So yeah, we're just gonna check out all of the the stuff. We've got giant dogs there. He said that Dorman said something about one of the toys to the little girl. It's like, oh, you like that one? It goes sixty-five thousand dollars, and it's yours. Pops, pops, pops. Lots and lots and lots of pops. Pops, pops, pops. Ooh, they got villain stuff. They got Funko makeup. Villain's makeup. There we go. Okay, so we came to Ellen's Stardust Diner and you can see across the street there is a line going all the way around the building and down the street. Um, so we're going to have to pass on Ellen's Starlight Stardust Diner on this trip, but it does mean we will have to come back to New York soon so we can do it. Because yeah, we've been waiting a very long time to get in there. So we're going to find food elsewhere. We have another new plan. We've remembered that we have to pay for getting the cab back to the airport. So, yeah, we don't really have money to, to sit down and eat meal and tip and stuff. So, Subway it is, we're going to... Yeah, I love the art decoriness of that as well. Edison just walks around. Um, that's what the uh, restaurant in Disney Springs is like. Oh, is it? Yeah, the Edison. Ah. Very cool. Our plans changed again. We got Sticky's finger joint. Chicken. <laughs> so look at these oh, fries. What are these? Mac fries. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. That's orgasmic. <laughs> okay, and then here's mine. My chicken fingers and my fries are underneath, but it comes with like three dips, so I got three dips in there. Okay, so the chicken from Sticky's Finger Joint is very good. It's moist, delicious, succulent, and juicy. There's little doubt in my mind that the primary injury occurred. Mm, very good. Good morning, everybody. It's our last day today. I've just asked about late checkout, and because the hotel is fully booked, there's no late checkouts. So we have just over an hour to get all the rest of our stuff packed up and downstairs and checked out. And then we have a long time until we have to get to the airport. So I'm not sure what we're going to do. Yeah, so. We'll see how this goes. It's gonna be an interesting day. It's gonna be a long day. A long day of traveling. So we're traveling. The flight we're getting, I think, is at seven something. I don't have my phone on me, so I can't like double check that. But we're flying in the evening and we're landing at like 6 a.m. UK time on Monday. So it's, um, I'm praying, fingers crossed, I can sleep on the flight. Okay, we are all packed up. I'm having to wear my hat because it does not fit in the case. Um, the, <laughs> the suitcases are packed to the brim, full of stuff, and yeah. Right, goodbye room, goodbye comfy bed. Go, 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 go. We're in the lift on the way to the airport to get us home. I'm sad about it. I don't want to go home. I want to live here. <laughs> the rest of my life. It's only a two hour flight to Disney World from here. Two hours. And the flights can be like a hundred dollar return. That's crazy. And not fair. We are heading over the Brooklyn Bridge though. This is cute.
she is. I don't know what she's doing. You're such a liar. <laughs> Here endeth the New York vlog. I hope you guys have really enjoyed it. Um, let me know in the comments down below what your favorite part of this trip has been. What is the most thing you would love to see if you go to New York? Um, if you do have any tips for us to improve our tip trip next time we go, do also let me know in the comments down below. I would love to hear them. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you really, really soon. That's pretty much it. There'll be a new video uh, like a whole video coming soon featuring myself and Craig talking about all the stuff that we got in New York. So it's a goodbye from me and a goodbye from Craig. Ciao. <laughs> we'll see you really soon. Mwah. Goodbye. Oh, don't forget to subscribe. Mm -hmm. Bye.